Confidence goes a long way towards success. And the confidence of these Westerners is superb. I happened in September of 1883 to be in the city of Bismarck in Dakota, when this young settlement was laying the cornerstone of its capital. The town was then only some five years old and was gaily decorated for the occasion. In one of the speeches, it was proved that as Bismarck was the center of Dakota, Dakota the center of the United States, and the United States the center of the world, Bismarck was destined to be the metropolitan hearth of the world's civilization. However, the feature of the ceremonial which struck us Europeans most was the spot chosen for the capital. It was not in the city, nor even on the skirts of the city. It was nearly a mile off, on the top of a hill in the brown and dusty prairie. Why here, we asked. Is it because you mean to enclose the building in a public park? By no means, was the answer. The capital is intended to be in the center of the city. It is in this direction that the city is to grow. It is the same everywhere from the Pacific to the Mississippi. Men seem to live in the future rather than in the present. They see the country not merely as it is, but as it will be, 20, 50, a hundred years hence. Lord James Bryce. <laughs>